On September 25, 2024, Ember formally announced its intensified efforts to position its C-390 Millennium Multi-Mission Transport aircraft as the replacement for the aging fleet of C-130s currently in service with the South African Air Force, SAF. This announcement was made in conjunction with the Africa Aerospace and Defense, AAD, International Exhibition, a major defense event held at the Watercliffe Air Base from September 18 to 22. The event provided a platform for Emberer to showcase the C-390's advanced capabilities to a global audience of defense experts, government officials and aviation professionals. Among the notable attendees were South African President Matamila Cyril Ramaphosa and Minister of Defense Angie Macheka, further highlighting the significance of the occasion. The C-390 Millennium has earned international recognition for its robust performance in diverse military missions. Capable of transporting up to 26 tons of cargo at high speeds, the aircraft is designed to operate in a wide range of environments, making it an attractive solution for military forces. The aircraft's versatility allows it to perform missions such as tactical transport of troops, vehicles and equipment, medical evacuations, disaster management, humanitarian aid, search and rescue operations, rapid crisis response, aerial refueling, and firefighting. These characteristics make the C-390 Millennium an excellent candidate to fulfill the strategic transport needs of the South African Air Force. The aircraft is currently operated by the Brazilian Air Force, and Portugal has two units in service. Additionally, countries such as South Korea and the Czech Republic have selected the C-390, although they have not yet finalized purchase contracts. In July 2024, a joint procurement agreement was signed between the Netherlands and Austria for nine C-390 Millennium aircraft with five units destined for the Royal Netherlands Air Force and four for the Austrian Air Force. Hungary also confirmed the delivery of its own C-390 Millennium this year, further extending the aircraft's global footprint. Africa is becoming an increasingly important market for the C-390, with Embraer making significant inroads into the continent. In 2023, Embraer inaugurated the first KC-390 Millennium simulator in Africa, providing local training capabilities for pilots and crews. That same year, a C-390 Millennium was transported to Watercliffe Air Base for a dynamic demonstration to senior officials from the South African Ministry of Defense and the SAF. The successful demonstration highlighted the aircraft's potential as a replacement for the SOF's current C-130 fleet. As part of this year's AAD exhibition, the C-390 made its second visit to South Africa, allowing the SAF to conduct a deeper evaluation of the aircraft's performance and capabilities. The South African government and military leaders, including the SANDF, expressed their interest in the aircraft's broad range of missions and advanced technology. Ember sees this interest as a positive step forward in the ongoing selection process to renew South Africa's strategic lift capacity. Bosco da Costa Jr., President and CEO of Ember Defense and Security, emphasized the importance of the South African National Defense Forces, SANDF, commitment to professionalism throughout the selection process. He stressed that the C-390 Millennium is not only strategically important for the SANDF but also offers exceptional versatility, range and speed that would meet the needs of various South African government agencies. According to Da Costa Jr., the C-390 is well positioned to serve as a key asset for the SANDF in terms of logistics, humanitarian support and crisis response. As Emperor promotes the C-390 Millennium, it faces stiff competition particularly from Lockheed Martin's C-130J Super Hercules. The C-130J has been a dominant force in the military transport aircraft market for decades, and many air forces around the world, including South Africa's, have relied on it for strategic transport. However, Embraer's C-390 Millennium presents a strong alternative, boasting superior payload capabilities and faster deployment times compared to the C-130J. These advantages could prove decisive as air forces globally, including the SAF, seek to modernize their fleets. The competition to replace legacy C-130s is fierce, with many countries evaluating multiple options to meet their strategic transport needs. In this context, the C-390 Millennium stands out due to its advanced technology, mission flexibility, and superior performance under challenging operational conditions. For South Africa, replacing its aging C-130 fleet with a state-of-the-art platform like the C-390 could significantly enhance its ability to respond to national and international missions, ranging from humanitarian aid to military operations. Emberus' announcement at the AAD International Exhibition underscores the company's commitment to securing the South African Air Force as a key operator of the C-390 Millennium. With its proven capabilities, 
the C-390 offers a compelling solution for modern military transport, standing as a viable contender against the C-130J Super Hercules. As South Africa continues to evaluate its options, the C-390 Millennium remains well-positioned to fulfill the SOF's future strategic needs, enhancing its operational readiness for years to come.